The eighth grade students at Tupelo Middle School spent part of their day digging in the dirt. Yeah, it had to be a lot of fun. It was part of a field trip to search for fossils as the students wrap up their study of geology. Allie Martin caught up with the class and has more. Oh, Half an hour into the fossil dig, the eighth graders had made some unique discoveries. Some of them are oysters and the rest are rocks I don't know. We found two different types of shark teeth. Tia Green teaches eighth grade science and came up with this project called Digging Up Bones. It is funded through a grant from the Association for Excellence in Education. We're bringing our curriculum to life. Over two days, Tupelo Middle School science students searched for fossils, rocks, and other evidence of the period when water covered this region. This that we're looking at today is the Cretaceous period. So it's one thing to talk about it in class, but it's another thing so they can come out here and it brings it to life. The young geologist also got some expert help from the Mississippi Natural Science Museum. George Phillips is a paleontologist and says, the students are gaining a lot of knowledge, not just about the prehistoric world, but also their current environment. So the kids are observing a lot here today, not just the fossils, but the wildlife. We're seeing grasshoppers and various types of beetles. So they're really experiencing the outdoors in a major way. Uh, we're seeing living animals and we're seeing the remains of ancient ones. And most of them seem to be pretty impressed by what's going on here. What's fun about being out here is that we get to learn about all the fossils and at the end they're going to tell us more about the fossils that we know of. It's very shiny in the sand because of the shells from the crustaceous era. This is the first year for the Digging Up the Bones hands-on field trip. Telling your story in Lee County, Allie Martin, WCBI News.